opening with the king's pawn controls the center and opens up the light squared bishop and queen, often leading to sharp games. The French defense prepares for d5, but blocks in the light squared bishop in exchange for a strong center and counter attacking chances. d4 grabs full control of the center and opens up the dark squared bishop. d5 is a counter attack in the center that threatens the e4 pawn. nd2 develops the knight and defends the e4 pawn. nf6 attacks the e4 pawn and supports the d5 pawn. e5 closes the center attacks the knight on f6, and controls the d6 and f6 squares. Nf d7 retreats the attack knight and prepares the c7 c5 pawn break. Bd3 develops the bishop, controls the e4 square and attacks h7. c5 attacks the d4 pawn and prepares to develop the knight to c6 behind the c pawn. c3 defends the d4 pawn and allows the queen to develop on the queen side. And c6 develops the knight and attacks the d4 and e5 pawns. And e2 develops the knight, protects the d4 pawn and prepares castling. Cx d4 releases the tension in the center and attacks the pawn on c3. Cx d4 recaptures the pawn and opens up the c3 square. F6 attacks the e5 pawn, but slightly weakens black's king side. X6 captures the f6 pawn and opens up the center. Nx f6 captures the pawn, recentralizes the knight and unblocks the light squared bishop. This mobilizes the knight, allowing it to control more of the board. This develops a queen off its starting square, getting it into the action. Castling gets the king to a safer square, out of the center of the board, while also developing a rook. Castling kingside tends to be safer because the king is further from the center. This activates a bishop by developing it off of its starting square. This develops a bishop off its starting square, getting it into the action. Castling develops a rook, while also moving the king to safety. Castling to the same side of the board as the opponent tends to lead to less sharp positions as compared with opposite side castling. It is the last book move. This develops a rook off its starting square, getting it into the action. It is best. This threatens to win a pawn. It is an inaccuracy. This blocks the attack on a pawn that could have been captured. This is the only move that works. This threatens to win a pawn. This prevents the opponent from being able to win a pawn. It is a great move. This stops the opponent from being able to win a pawn. It is best. That's fine. It is good. That's not a mistake but it's not the best move either. It is good. The rooks can see each other now, allowing them to provide mutual defense. It is excellent. This connects the rooks, which helps them coordinate together in the future. It is best. This is not the right idea. It is an inaccuracy. The game was close to equal, but now white has the advantage. It is an inaccuracy. The opposing knight is kicked by a pawn, and must now move or be captured. It is good. This move puts the knight on a safer square. It is best. This takes an outpost, an active square where the knight cannot be kicked out by a pawn. It is best. This misses an opportunity to offer an equal trade of pieces. This allows the opponent to kick a bishop. It is an inaccuracy. Takes back. It is best. This move puts the bishop on a safer square. It is good. This attacks a knight, winning a tempo when it moves away. This is the only good move. This threatens to win material. It is a great move. This offers an equal trade of pieces. It is best. This defends the attacked knight. This threatens to win material. It is best. There were worse moves but also something much better. It is an inaccuracy. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. That's a sensible reply. It is excellent. The knight now occupies an outpost, a secure square in the opponent's territory. It is best. Very precise. It is best. This is not the best. It is an inaccuracy. 
This offers to exchange pieces of equal value. It is best. White still has the better position, but they lost their winning advantage. It is an inaccuracy. This is a fair move. It is good. This allows the opponent to push a passed pawn towards promotion. It is an inaccuracy. This loses material. It is a mistake. This overlooks an opportunity to win material. It is an inaccuracy. This wins a tempo by threatening a queen and forcing it to move away. It is good. This moves the queen to safety. It is good. This leads to losing a pawn. It is a mistake. That was a great move and very hard to find. This is the only good move. It is brilliant. This misses an opportunity to threaten winning a queen. It is an inaccuracy. After all captures, this is an equal trade. It is best. Recaptures. It is best. Right on target. It is best. This moves the pawn to safety. This threatens to kick a bishop. It is good. This is the way to win a queen. This is the only move that works. This prevents the opponent from being able to kick a bishop. It is a great move. This steps away from the checking queen. It is best. Capturing that pawn wins material. It is best. This moves the queen to safety. It is excellent. This strikes at the center, countering the opponent's ability to grab space. It is best. The pawn is now passed because it can no longer be challenged by opposing pawns as it tries to promote. It is best. This pushes a passed pawn. It is best. Intense that was a serious game. White really outplayed black in that one. Black had a good opening, but white was on another level. White was a cut above black in the middle game. 